Namaste, good morning everyone. Let's continue into our sadhana, our practice together. Finding a comfortable seat, sitting upright with straight spine, chin up. And then gently or softly close your eyes. And just begin to follow a soft, a conscious breath. Inhale consciously and exhale consciously, feeling that flow of energy moving down through your susumna, your central nadi as you inhale. And as you exhale, visualizing the energy flowing up through your susumna nadi back towards your crown. So we have been practicing through Sukha Vritti, then the Savitri. Today can we practice Sukha Purvaka, which is the complete or the square breathing. We inhale for six, hold for six, exhale for six, and hold out for six, bringing a sense of stability or connection with our roots, with the earth, with the Prathvi, the solidarity. So inhaling and moving the energy from your crown down through your Susumna, your central nadi, hold into Muladhara center chakra. As you exhale, move from Muladhara to the crown and hold out at Sahasrara. Follow this for a few minutes.
And it's time to let go of your breath, your pranayam. Gently bring your hands to your heart, Namaskar Mudra. So you raise your arms in a big circle to Anjali Mudra and with the Brahmari humming, bringing them through Sahasrara, third eye, Vishuddha and Anahata with the Brahmari, the humming sound. So breathe out, breathe in, take your arms in a big circle all the way up and over your head. Chatuspata work just to enhance or extend our breath to continue a little bit further into pranayama. So let's move up into four feeted Chatuspata asana when you're all ready. If you need to just simply tap your feet, your, your wiggle, your ankle joints, your toes, and just simply move side to side, give a little massage, waking up into your hips, on your knees. You can gently bend your elbows to also massage your shoulder blades. Just a little bit of loosening up. And if you feel you're comfortably ready, then hold up into four footed. Head down, Vyagra Pranayam, breathe out. Breathe in, dip your spine down, arch your back, head up. Breathe out, reverse, reverse arching your back, chin into your chest, to squeeze into your shoulder blades. Two more, breathe in, dip down, open up. And out. In. Out. And again, breathe in. And breathe out. And back to forfeited that's spada. So now we're going to follow our salva kiriyat. We're going to move through our right leg, left leg, right hand, left hand. Head down, breathe out. Breathe in, raise your right leg and your head up, extend, open your right lung, out and release. Left leg, left leg in, and out. Right down, breathe in, raise up, and out. And left arm in and out. Just taking a little pause. Second round, breathe out. Right leg in. Out and release. Left leg in. And release. Right arm in and release and then left arm in and release 
Let's follow third round, right leg in, extend. And out. Left leg in. And out. And right arm in. And out. Left arm in and out. Lovely. Now gently release, relax, back on your heels, head down to the floor, to your knees, letting go. Okay, let's simply come back to four free kicks at the spada again on our hands and knees. So we're going to continue our chiri kiriya. So let's start with the right leg, head down, breathe out. Breathe in, raise your right leg and your head up, arch your back. And breathe out, bringing your head and knee together, squeeze all the air out. Two more, breathe in. And out. And again, breathe in and out. And then release. Let's follow it with the left leg. Breathe out. Breathe in. Raise your left leg and your head. Arch up. And breathe out. Bring your head and your knee together. Two more. Breathe in. Out, in, out, and again in, and out, and then release, relax, let's follow it with our arms, so right arm, breathe out, Breathe in, swing open your right arm all the way to the sky, twist back. Breathe out, take your right hand to your left buttock, turn and twist and look through your arm. Breathe in, open and expand your breath, your lungs, your spine. And breathe out, squeeze all the stale air out. And again, breathe in, open up. And out. And then release, go relax. Let's work with the left arm, breathe out. Breathe in, swing open to the left. And breathe out. Continuing in. Out. In. And out. And again in. And out. And then release. Relax into Sasanka for a couple of moments. Just feel that easing and a deep rhythmic breath. Let's come back to four feet eight, so the spada again. And we complete it with coming back to Vyagra Pranayama and we go to again do a Sukha Purvaka, the square breath. Head down, breathe out. Breathe in, take your spine down, arch your back, head up. Hold and also hold the Mula Bandha. Simply breathe out. And as you're breathing out, begin to hold your bandha. Hold all three bandhas as you hold the breath. Again, breathe 
again in hold out hold in hold out hold and release Gently relax. When you're ready, slowly and gently come back up to seated position. And now choose one of your most comfortable posture. And today we're going to move into the Surya Vedana and the Chandra Vedana Pranayam. So, so far we have been practicing Surya Nadi and Chandra Nadi. So, in the Surya and Chandra Vedana, we hold our out breath, the Bahira Kumbhaka, and with that we hold the, the, all the three bandhas, the Mahabandha. So, if you're ready, sit straight, bringing your left hand on your lap. Bring your right hand for Pranayama Mudra, breathe out. Now close your left nostril in through the right. Out right. Hold out and hold your bandhas. Release your bandhas in right. Out right. Hold. Holding the bandha. Release and in through right. Out right. Hold out. Release, relax your right hand on your knee in your Jnana Mudra. Sit still, sit quiet for a couple of moments. Feel that abundance of warm golden energy of the Surya into your right side. This is our Saraswati Chalana. We're going to follow this with the left side into our Chandra Nadi. The pranayama again is same. Inhale through the left, exhale through the left. And then we hold out, holding the bandhas. With our focus into the left side, this is the Sakti Chalana. So bring your right hand into Pranayama Mudra again. Breathe out. Close your right nostril in through the left. Out through the left. Hold out. Release the bandhas in through the left. Out left. Hold. Hold. 
Team. Out. Hold out. Again, release, relax your right hand. Now, focusing the energy into the left side, the cool, healing lunar energy or the moon energy. Okay, now we're going to follow Surya and Chandra Vedana to align the Saraswati and the Sakti or the Surya and the Chandra energies. So bring your right hand into Pranayama Mudra again. Breathe out. Close your left nostril in through the right. Out through the right. Hold out, hold the bandha. Release and in through the left. Out left. Hold out. In right, out right, hold, in left. Out left, hold out, one more round in right, out right, In left, out left, hold. Focusing your energy into your central channel, your Susumna. This beautiful energy of the Surya and the Chandra intertwined, flowing freely in harmony. The beach mantra today is the cling, cling. Now this is when the energy is naturally flowing in through our sesumna or the central channel, the central nadi. So we will follow that mantra sadhana as part of the layer. Om Kling. Om Kling. So let's start three times. Breathe in. Om Kling. Clean. 
repeating, reciting the mantra in your mind. Manasik Japa. Om Kling. Om Kling. And with the Japa, feel this continuous flow of the energy from the Muladhara up towards your crown bringing a sense of abundance or vitality or flow to your being. Om Kling, Om Kling. Keep coming back to our beach mantra, Om Kling, Om Kling. Time to let go and just feel this abundant energy rising through, creating a beautiful halo or the glow from within and all over.
Gently bring your hands to heart in Namaskar and let's recite our Santi Mantra. We'll sound three times together today. Join if you wish to. Om, Om Shanti Shanti Let's 